Hey everyone, so my name is Shippy Williams, I am your health, wellness, and fitness accountability coach, and I help you reach your goals by holding you accountable for reaching them. One way I do that is with these awesome free workouts that you get to do from home. All right, so you guys know what time it is. It is time to get excited about today's workout. Yep, yep, whoo. Out of breath, you all know why if you've been following me. Just did 50 push ups. <laughs> all right, so today is our 10 minute stretching day. So we're gonna focus today on our lower body parts, really on our legs, because <laughs> this is an area I really need to stretch that is really, really tight. So we're just gonna go ahead and get started. But here's the rules rule number one always give 100%. My 100%, your 100%, don't look at anything in life. You just give your 100%. Number two, always do your best, which means to use correct form, even when stretching. And number three, take breaks. Take as many breaks as you need to, to get through the stretching part, right? So if you need to take a break and we're holding it too long, don't worry, just come out, take a break and come back down in. So because we're just focusing on legs, and like our lower body parts, um, we're going to be holding the stretches a little bit longer and then we're going to go right into our three minute meditation. Here we go. Three, two, All right. One. Legs out straight. Breathe up, look up, come down. Now as you come down with your legs straight, toes up, you're going to feel that stretch in the back of your legs, right? Hold it as long as you can. So first of all, come down as far as you can. Okay, so look up, don't look down. You can touch your toes, great. If not, touch your ankles, you can touch your shins, you can touch your thighs. Just go as low as you can with your back straight, right? So let me show you, like this, not like this. Back is straight. You're going down as far as you can with your back straight, you should feel a good stretch. All right, here we go. Now, try and go down a little bit more. Try to keep that back flat if you can. If you can't, just come up, keeping your back flat, right? No hunching over, back is flat. Shoulders are down and back, and then you go down a little bit more. Okay, come on up, right? We're gonna go back up again. Now this time, go down. You can hunch your back and go as far as you can. You feel that stretch. I feel this like <laughs> some of every place. Taking deep breaths in and out. Head is down. Keep holding. All right, roll up. Run face again. Ready? Arms up and forward. Oh. And you can touch your toes, great. If not, you just stay at your ankles or at your shins and come down as far as you can. Feet together, if you can get your knees together. Knees together. Stretching back at the legs. Woo. Now, if you can put your toe, your hands, your fingers on your toes, pull your toes back, you'll feel the stretch. And that stretch will go right down the back of the legs. So if you pull your toes back, then go down, you'll see you can't go down as far. So head down and feel that stretch. Breathing in and out. Okay, roll up. Whew, gosh. <laughs> All right, let's open our legs up. Pull the shorts down here. And we're gonna stretch those inner thighs. So open as far as you can. 
And just from here, I feel, because I'm opening them as far as I can, I can feel a stretch already. Even if I had touch here, it's tight. So, let's lean over to one side. We'll stretch this part. Now, turn this way, look down, and come down as far as you can go. And hold it there. Feet up. Now you may even feel this stretch go down your back, right? Walk it up, sit up straight, turn to the other side, lean over first. I feel, I feel a stretch when I lean, my toes up. Now turn and come down. And we're gonna hold it, right? If it gets too much for you, you can come up some to take a break. But a lot of times, this is what we're missing from our workout, a really good stretch. So you can do this more than one round if you want. Okay, come on up. One more time. We're almost halfway through. All right, lean over. We're gonna do our um, Achilles and calves next, because that is something I definitely need to hit. Now look down, then we'll sit back on the floor. I definitely wanna make sure I hit to those today. Go down as deep as you can. Head down, looking at your knee. Come on up, walk it up. Other side. Turn that way and come over. And one side may seem like it's tighter than the other, probably because it is. It's the size you work the most may be tighter. So your dominant side. Now, let's turn, look down, stretch. Breathing in and out, looking down at the knee. All right, walk it up. Now, let's bring our legs close together. All right, so let's go ahead and we're gonna go into a pyramid or a downward dog position and start stretching those calves out. You guys ready? Go up in the air, feet separated if they're not, and just walk it out. Walk. Yes, this is what I need because I've been doing a lot of running and not stretching, which is terrible. Right, so stretching those calf muscles out. If you need to, if you can't do it this way, you can use the wall, right? Walking it out, walking it out. Now some of you may be able to get your heel on the floor. I can't, <laughs> I never can. <laughs> but my calves are just too tight. All right, so we're going to stretch our Achilles tendon, which is at the bottom. All right, so now here with this leg, bend this knee right here. Now what you should feel is a stretch go down here, uh, down by the back of the, uh, this is your Achilles tendon down here. So stretch that, straighten your leg, switch. All right, so now we bend this knee right here. As you can see, bend it. Woo! Stretch that Achilles tendon. I need to do this more often. Oh, just so you guys can see. Whew. Lots of walking. We do lots of walking and running. Switch. This is an exercise you really should do so you don't pull your Achilles tendon muscle. Bend that knee. As I have pulled it before. Straighten your leg, switch. Bend this knee, right? Bend that knee. Stretching that Achilles tendon out. Come down. Let's do it one more time each side. 
here, bend. Don't forget, you can do this using your wall or chair or bed or whatever you want. Switch. Bend that knee. Plus the blood is rushing to my head. <laughs> so here we go. All right, here we go. Come down to your knees. Now, I'm gonna stretch uh, the groin area. So we're gonna go straight into here. Leg in front, right leg in back. And you can either be, you move the hand up way, on your knee or you can be on your toe. I prefer my knee instead. You're just leaning forward into the stretch, right? Stretching this area right here. Let's switch. We're almost done. <laughs> 10 minutes went by that fast. All right, so we're here. You can sit up here if you want. It's like a runner stretch, or you can come down here. Let's switch one more time. And switch. This is going to be our last 10 seconds. And we're going to lay down. This is it. Meditation. Right into it. Y'all know what to do. Okay, that's it for today's workout. Hope you guys enjoyed that 10 minute stretch and that three minute meditation that all of it went by so fast. 
So you guys, I will see you in the next video. Make sure you check out the links in the post or description box. Visit my website, www.lbxfitness.com. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, LBX Fitness, and I will see you guys again in the next video. Bye, everyone.